Player moments. Serginho Dest. Base or mid? No. Correct me in saying that. Mid or prime icon packs are here. Absolutely brilliant with those. And then two absolutely shocking SPCs. Uh, it's just you know, two amazing SPCs and then two shocking ones today, as well as Team of the Year Defenders. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, comment. Okay, good stuff. And let's get right into the video. Hope you guys do enjoy. Hello, what's up guys? Welcome back to yet another 6 p.m. content video on the channel. And now today we do have Team of the Year Defenders, which you definitely already know. You can see them right there, but they've been leaked for a while now. It's Jao Cancelo, Ruben Diaz, Marquinhos, Asher Hakimi, and Donnarumma. Those are the five players that we have got. But starting off with turning on my controller, because that was not the case. It was not on. Start off with objectives. What are we saying, dude? Anything in objectives today? Um, no, but tomorrow, you know what we do have? We have Silver Stars, Josh Sargent, which I am absolutely buzzing for. We better get Silver Star We better get Josh Sargent. He, he better he better get it. He, he be better get it. That's all I'm saying. Um, now, on to the store. What type of promos do we have today? Let's browse those. Go over to promos, and we have the standard 100k lightning rounds, 45k packs, the 1178 to 80 rare gold players, and the 25k packs. So, that's what we've got going on in the store today. Now on to the best content always, the SBCs. Let's see what we have going on over here. Boom. Dest. Serginho Dest Moments SBC. Oh, that, yeah, I mean, I don't... Again, these moments cards are kind of eh, but I guess it was it was a crucial goal. It was an absolute banger, but I, I'll a moments card. I don't know. 82 and 85 rated squad, which if I check footbin comes out to around 115k. That is not too bad at all. 85 and an 82 rated squad with a team of the week in each. 55 and 60 cam with uh, Barcelona and Stanton their player. That's not too shabby. I'll tell you that for a fact. Now, look at the stats. High, medium, four-star, four-star. Amazing pace. Decent shooting for a fullback. Very good passing. Crossing is good. Short passing is class. Agility is absolutely amazing. He's got very good composure. Great reactions. Good balance. Great defending stats. Defensive awareness is 88. Stand tackle, 88. Slide tackle, 87. Interceptions, 87. 98 stamina this card actually looks absolutely actually actually absolutely unreal I, I don't know why i said the word a few times i thought it would like add an element of interest to the video which is probably pointless because it definitely doesn't but this card looks very good that's all i'm gonna say he looks very very good i'm impressed i'm impressed da very good value sbc right there now what else do we have do we have anything else today uh team of your challenge three for a gold players pack and it is a what kind of squad? <sighs> um, all right, let's switch and move on from that. Um, team of the Year trial. A lone Team of the Year player on a 10 match loan. Okay. You get a lone team of the year for an 83 rated squad. It can be any team of the year. A 10 game loan, which means 10 champs matches. I mean, if you want to do this and use them in champs this weekend, that's why I would do that to use the card in champs. But do anything else? Team of the year kits. Let's head over to live to see, because I checked. I know we have some other stuff, so. Let's head over to live so we get to go and see it. Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. The mid or prime icon upgrade. Now, Footbin's absolutely loving this one with an 89% upvote to a 11% downvote. It's 530k, which I'll tell you is definitely not too bad considering the icon SPCs we've seen in the past in terms of value. So, mid or prime icon back. Decent. An 85, 86, 86, and 87 with team of the weeks in two and then no team of the weeks in the others and i mean you get okay packs back it's not repeatable you have 13 days to complete it 
not too bad. Not too bad, none the least. I would definitely consider doing that instead. If you were considering doing the pick, I would do this instead. 100%. I would do this one instead because it's just, it's cheaper than the pick. It's that simple. Um, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a good content day. Team of the Year defenders are here. Let's make sure I'm not missing out on anything. Um, yeah, I mean, the Team of the Year challenge. I, I don't... They always do that with the 80 rated squad with the gold players pack. They always do it. And it's so dumb. Like it, it annoys me every time I see it. It's the same thing when we re they released the draft SBC for a squad that's more expensive than just buying a draft with coins. They do it so often too. Like they do it every promo and I just don't get it. Like just get rid of it. Cause it, it, there's so many more things that could annoy me on this game. But the little things like that are what get me absolutely infuriated somehow. I don't know why it does, but it does, right? It just does. So, yeah, yeah. Get that out. Get that away from me. The Mark Goldbridge clip. That's just a absolutely awful. Absolutely awful. But this isn't awful. This is not awful. I, I really like the look of that. What a flip and thick even. 87% upvote to a 13% downvote. So, in my opinion, Two insanely good SBCs today, and two absolutely shocking SBCs today. Two insane ones, the Dest and the Icon Pack. Two terrible ones, the Team of the Year Trial for the lone Team of the Year, and the Team of the Year Challenge 3. Just, just absolutely awful. I don't think I can say anything else other than they were absolutely awful. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> It's just a shocking one from EA. It's a very, very shocking one. 12K for the Team of the Year Trial SBC. And save your fodder for other stuff. Team of the Year Challenge. I mean, it, let me just look at this again real quick. It, requ it requires a lot of rares. Oh, it doesn't. One rare, to be fair, actually. But an 80 rated squad. You're probably going to put a few rares in there. But rares at this moment are currently needed for all the upgrade SBCs. So. Yeah, that, that's why you don't want to be completing that because you know, don't be smart, right? I'm being smart personally. The only reason, I, I, the only reason I would not do the eye compact, right, is because we have a highly leaked Rafa Varane flashback SBC that I assume a lot of you have seen, right? It's been everywhere, like. I try my best to stay away from the leaks. I just can't. They somehow find a way to see, like, get to me all the time. Um, the leaks aren't bad, but I, I like the element of just being able to like see the content, you know, and just like be happy and surprised. I like to be like, I don't like for it to be spoiled, but it is. It's just everywhere at this point. Um, but he's going to be insanely expensive. That Varon is going to be so expensive. And if we're going to complete this SBC, if you want to complete this SBC, you're going to need a lot of fodder and coins. I'm stocking up my fodder right now to do that Varan SBC. There's also a highly leaked Luke Shaw, which would be a great link and objectives that will probably come out when they're all in packs. So yeah, let's keep that in mind. If you guys did enjoy this one, make sure to leave a like, comment, all the good and good stuff, and I'll catch you in the next one tomorrow for Josh Sargent and the new team of the week. I'll catch you then.